Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, hey, what is up? My name is VNA Strick. Thank you so, so much for being here. I really, truly appreciate it. Uh, so today's had to do a review video on a makeup brush set that I bought on Amazon. It is a 14 piece set and they were very, very, a little too affordable. So I decided to test them out and tell you guys my thoughts. Uh, these brushes I used on my face today for like 99% of my makeup. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, then you should do that right now and join the squad. Join the squad. Join and I'll stop singing, how about that? Okay guys, so let's just jump right into it. This is the brush set from BS Small. That's what the brand is. I did buy it off of Amazon and it's a 14 piece set of makeup brushes. Now, these did come in a little bag like this. They were individually wrapped. I just took all the wrapping off because I needed to do some product shots. And I think I paid around $10 for it. I'll put the exact um, price right here. So this is what it comes in. It also comes with a little sheet kind of like explaining to you like what they're all supposed to be in their use. So I'm just gonna tell you all the names of the brushes and show them to you. So we have an angled brush, a flat angled brush, face flat brush, round powder brush, tapered brush, blending brush, angled eyeshadow brush, classic eyeshadow brush, concealer brush, precise brush, detail brush, angled detail brush, classic detailed brush, eyeliner brush. So off first impressions, um, I obviously haven't used these brushes yet. I'm actually gonna use them with you on camera so you can see how they apply. This is what they look like. They are very, very, very soft. Um, I think they, they look a lot better than I thought they were gonna look. So I'm pretty impressed just like offhand like what they look like. Like if you can see they're like really nicely compacted and they're just so soft. I definitely love that. So I guess we'll just try on the face. I'm not gonna do like a super specific tutorial because this isn't like a makeup tutorial. This is just like, let's test how these brushes work. So I'm gonna try my best to like just use every single brush here for whatever way I can use them and let's see what we can come up with. I'm quickly gonna prime my face with my Milani primer. So for foundation, I never ever use a brush, but we're gonna use a brush today, you know, because we wanna try these out. So I guess I'm gonna use the flat Kabuki brush and apply my foundation with it. I'll be using my Born This Way foundation. Okay, so, so good so far. This is like not super stiff because I do have like a really stiff Kabuki brush. It's the Kiko one and this is kind of like too stiff to be blending stuff out. So I like this because it's nice like compacted but it's like kind of like fluffy. So it, I mean, it's spread out evenly. I got good coverage, no shedding just yet. And um, I didn't leave any streak marks or anything. So pretty impressed with this. Moving on, just for the heck of it, I'm gonna use a brush to put my corrector on my eyes. So this is the small eyeshadow brush. It's just like a regular flat brush. Now, like, I'm hoping for the best, but like, I don't need much hoping, like it's looking pretty good. So for concealer, I'm just gonna put a little bit of shape tape and a little bit of LA Girl concealer. Honestly, I don't think I've ever blended out my concealer with anything other than the sponge. So this is gonna be a little weird, but I've always wanted to blend it out with like a pointed brush like this. This is a face tapered brush, so let's just give it a try. I don't know if I like it like more than a sponge but this little point right here 
is really good for getting in that little corner right there for your eye socket. I'm not mad about it. All right, so let's set it. I guess I'll just set it with this angled brush. This is a face brush, but let's just, I wanna use all of them. This is really soft. It kind of feels good on the face. Okay, to contour, should have used this to set my face. Yeah, that would have worked better. Well, I'm gonna use the same one to contour because this is really flat, but this feels really good under the eyes. So this might be good to set as well. So, and this is the, the face flat angled brush. Honestly, I've noticed that like I get product on the brush and it almost like all comes off on my face, which is a good thing. Like it's not soaking up product. I know it's powder, but like, I don't know. I'm starting to really like this. I guess I'm gonna try to bronze with this round brush. Let's just see how it goes, whatever. So far so good. So I'm gonna just move on to the eyes and then we can come back and finish the face. So for my eyes today, I will be using my uh, Morphe 35O palette. I figured that these are affordable, but they're great eyeshadows. So I wanna give these um, brushes a fair try. And I think that these are good eyeshadows to do that with. Again, this is not a tutorial and these shades don't have names. So I'm just gonna go in with a bunch of shades and kind of like smoke it out or something. So the smaller ones don't have the name of the brush, if you're curious. So I'm gonna use the blending brush and just grab a couple transition shades and just put it on my eyes. Take this brush right here. It's like a flat, fluffy brush. And I'm just gonna take a darker shade and kind of deepen up the crease a little bit. Right here I'm just going back in with those transition shades and blending this out. So far so good. I mean everything's blending out perfect. Um, these brushes are very soft so I'm, I'm, I'm impressed. I'm impressed. This is picking up like a lot of product so I really do like this. Okay, so this is what we have so far. I've just been going back and forth with the blending brush and I'm just kind of blending it all out. So these tiny little brushes, um, I wasn't gonna do like any gel liner today so I won't be using this brush and I'll just use one of these brushes to do like my inner corner highlight. So we do have this brush which is like a nice little eyebrow brush. It's angled and it has a nice spoolie in the back. Um, for my brows personally, I like using a flat brush to like, you know, get my shape. Don't worry if I don't use some of the brushes. I will keep using these in my tutorials and I'll let you guys know, keep you updated of if I like them or not. So I'm going to go back to that flat brush that I used to um, correct my under eye and I'm just going to cut my crease a little bit, just halfway, and then I'm going to pack another shade in. I'm gonna go back in with this pointed brush and I'm just gonna try to blend out all these edges. Okay, so I just did a thin line of eyeliner and some mascara. So let's just finish out the eyes. So I popped on some nude liner and some bottle lash mascara and now I'm going to highlight the inner corner. You know what I feel like this would be really good for? Like applying um, like glitter on the crease, you know like a cut crease with glitter. 
I feel like that would work really good for it. So I think we've used all of the brushes. Um, I don't have like a blush brush or like a highlighter brush. So I'm just gonna finish that up and then we can meet back up and I'll tell you my thoughts. So, thoughts. Just kidding, I love these. I mean, I think they're like, I still can't believe the price that I paid for 14 brushes that I had absolutely no problems with. These face brushes are so soft. I mean, they're all really soft, but I mean, I'm very impressed with these face brushes just because, you know, I feel like more time goes into making these and like the um, eye brushes. Obviously later, they might start like shedding, I don't know, but as of now, I really like them. I'm gonna keep using these in my tutorials because I really enjoy them. I think they're such a good price for 14 pieces. I am by no means like a makeup artist. I just enjoy doing makeup and I love learning about makeup. So I can't tell you that these are like the best or the worst brushes ever. If you haven't noticed in my videos, I don't really use super expensive makeup brushes because frankly, I don't need to. Like my makeup looks great. I mean, I'm not saying that a good makeup brush is not necessary, but it's like there's a lot of good makeup brushes that are very affordable. And I think these are one of them. Um, so far they've worked really great obviously i can only tell you for this past hour that i've been filming but yeah i honestly i recommend them if you're looking for a good brush set um i bought mine off of amazon honestly i was looking at morphe brushes on amazon because i have a uh, prime and i didn't want to pay for shipping and then i stumbled upon these and i was super curious and i was like you know what i'm gonna try them out make a video and then if, if it works out then maybe you guys can try them out so yeah, I really like these. I love them. I'm pretty, pretty happy about them. So yeah, I'll link them down below if you want to check them out. Um, again, they are like around ten dollars, and uh, if you are Prime, they'll be free shipping. They do have different shades. Um, I just picked these black ones because I don't know. I have so many colors of brushes, so I wanted some black ones. I believe they have like like a rose gold one and like maybe a silver one I'm not sure so you should check out different colors if you're interested so yeah I hope that if you guys end up buying it I hope you guys enjoy them if you do comment down below and let me know if you like them so yeah guys that was my review I hope that you guys enjoyed it if you did please give this video a thumbs up and let me know if you've tried these brushes out or if you plan on it and let me know if you like them or not comment it down below so yeah, let me know what other products you'd like me to review. Um, I would love to do that for you. And anyways, I hope you guys are having a great day or night wherever you are. And I really hope to catch you in my next video. Bye. So I hope that you guys really enjoyed it. If you did, please give this, visa, visa, give this video a thumbs up. Uh, uh. Okay, okay. Chill. Chill. So yeah, let's just hop right in. Why do I use my hands so much? Let's just hop right in. Like this video. Subscribe.